Hello guys and welcome back to Court Farms. Now then, in today's episode we are going to be doing a bit more combining. Um, as I do in fact have this whole field to do. Um, there's a chance that I'll most likely set this off for to combine. Um, just make sure I get down there done because if you didn't watch the end of last episode, the combine ended up off the map. So. We're going to do this a little bit by hand, um, just so that we can try, well, do as much as we can to stop it crashing. And plus, because it decided to uh, miss this part out. Um, so yeah, as well, I have a number of comments to read out. Make sure I get that straight first. Um, so yeah, I'll do them. Um, just a second, I'll get them loaded up. Right, I think I'll get that last triangle done there. And then I'll start, I'll drive down there and start down there a bit. Um, so, comments. Matt Retallick says, I have to say that Holly on your logo is very seasonal. Thank you. Matthew Scott, oh, sorry, Matthew Scott, um, and this was on my top five personal top five games. Um, his top five are FS15, FIFA 16, Euro Truck, GTA, The Crew, Wild Run, and Spin Tires. One, two, three, six. Um, Aiden Cummins says, FS15, GTA 5. Shane Riley, could I play multiplayer with you someday? AC Gaming, can I join you MP for these vids? Um, Criggs and well, Court Farms that was AC Gaming and the top five was Shane Riley. Um, Craig Sterling says, try to make snow be on the ground on off this map and do some snow plying. Um, wait a couple of days and there may be a bit of that. Um, but no, I, I don't really want to edit this map. I, I like it the way it is. Because um, it does invo involve changing some swaths and stuff. Um, so, next comment. Christopher Lowe says, Could you, can, sorry, can you do Woodside Farm, please? And that was on Copperback Farm. Shane Riley says, Oh, yeah, for a Christmas special, you should do a top five funny moments. To be honest, I haven't, <laughs> I haven't really got any. Um, yeah, Max West Cameron says thanks, I love it. And what was that replying to? Um, I don't know. I think I think that was, in fact no, that was a that was a reply to a comment. Um, Christopher Lowe, can you do Woodside Farm for a Christmas special, please? Matthew Scott, I'd like to see a Christmas special. JH Gaming, Shane Riley, and I would love. Christmas special. And yes, there is a Christmas special. Um, and when's this video going out? 22nd, a few couple of days. And Christmas specials will be there with you. Um, they are going to release, be released a bit earlier. i um, thinking about 10, um, 10, 11. Yeah, about 10 or 11. Because uh, doing a Christmas lunch. And I usually release the videos about 12. Uh, I think that's when I schedule them to go. Um, so yeah, I will try and set them up for about 11, 10, 11 o'clock. Um, and Shane Rye, make a map sometime. I think I read that comment out. I think it probably did, in fact. Um, so yeah. They are all the comments as well at this current time of recording. Um, what am I doing? Dashboard. Um, all we have had. I'll just wait for YouTube to load. What is it? Um, right, total views for the channel 21,675. Watch time in minutes. 87,938 minutes watched. That is quite a lot. 
<laughs> and it's just, oh, that's quite good. August there was a peak. Um, September there was a bit of a peak. December, crikey, there's been over a thousand minutes watched on like some days. Um, what else is there? Subscribers, let's have a look at that. According to YouTube, we have 242, and that is done from the 18th of December. That's quite a while ago, that's like three days ago, I think. Um, but I think at the moment there's a possibility we're at 248. Um, I'll have to uh, have a look at that. There's a chance 250 subscriber special will be on the 23rd or 24th. Um, but I still don't know what to do for it, I'll have to think of something. Um, so yeah. Let's have a look. In, in the lifetime of this channel, 96.8% of uh, ratings, like like and dislike, have been liked, so that is a nice thing to see. Um, uh, so yeah, anyway, let's get back on with combining and that sort of thing. Uh, so I'll do once more at this end, so I'll just do this once here. And I'll set it off going by itself so it shouldn't crash. If it does, I need to get another hired worker. It's pretty shocking what happened down there. Is it decided to drive all the way across the map and over the edge of uh, what, the map, um, like it is here. Um, right, there's a chance a multiplayer may be coming on this. Um, but Pretty much. Um, there, there's a chance there'll be not as many videos because we've got like two days to record, like two weeks worth or a week's worth, something like that. Um, so there's a chance that there will, will be not as many. Um, I'll try and put some out. I won't schedule them until I know I can get them out. And, uh, until I know how many there are. Anyway, set that going. What else have I got? Loaded there. Tracked in there. What equipment do I own? Hmm. I think I was looking at buying Corn header. The combine. Yes, I was. I wanted uh, that one, I think. No, um, this one, 12 meter. One. Buy that. And New Holland yellow. Um, so get that delivered down. Oh, wow. <laughs> the delivered down there. And I'll take a quick look. Leave the trailer here. Take a quick look down there. We'll just go have a look at what it's like. It should be a fairly decent header, actually. Um, I'm pretty sure that well, it should fit. Um, if it doesn't, then I don't know how I managed to get it fit last time. Um, but yeah. Are there as well? I learned how to use that. Um, which field is it? It's the next entrance up, I think. All right, here is the header. I could actually do with a trailer for that. That is very, very wide. Uh, even when it is folded. Um, I 
Unfortunately, I don't know of any decent trailers for that. The only ones I could think of would be uh, low loaders um, for the lorry. And I don't really want to have one of them. And it's because I can't afford a lorry. If I'd have to have something like a dolly that goes on the back of the tractor. But yeah. Let's drive back over there. How full is the combine? 77%. So I think I'll drive alongside it and just empty it now. Wait for it to get a bit more full and then I'll empty it. I've got the pipe out ready, in fact. So 90% will empty it. What I will do, I'll have a look at the uh, top videos on this channel. In fact, I'll empty it now whilst it's uh, available. Does it want me to go? Okay. Probably not. I bet I've come too far. Just a tad too far. That's annoying. Um. What do I want? Videos. I think it's on there. Most recent. Right. The most viewed videos. So. 2045 views on how to set up a wheel for FS15, 16 likes, one comment, how to install a mod for FS15, 1366 views, um, 9 likes, mods review of the New Holland bundle, 847 views, 2 comments, 1 like, mod review of the uh, JCB Fast Track D mount sprayer, 829 views, 3 comments, 3 likes, and then Cobra Park Farm. 564 views, 10 comments, 9 likes. Channington 2015 episode 1, 549 views, 9 likes, 14 comments. And Coal Farms Limited, and 260 views, uh, episode 1, sorry, um, 263 views, 3 comments, and 6 likes. So I'm quite happy with that actually. Um, so I've noticed Coal Farms, yeah, it's still quite popular. Um, so yeah, I'm quite happy with that. What could we do right now actually? We have this here. No, I still need to move all of the uh silage have I got? And I need to buy something to move it with. That was the uh, perfect trailer for what I needed it for. In fact, Stuart trailers. I get one of them, possibly. Although, can this tipper that we have at the moment move silage? Yes, it can. So, all I need now is a conveyor belt and I have the perfect mod for that um, well I have the perfect I have the, a mod in mind I don't even know if I have it I have got one in mind so I don't have it by the looks of it no I don't own it however Oh, hang on, I can't even put it in the clump, can I? Um, no. Apparently. I think I also need a mixer wagon, uh, so we'll have to think about buying one of them. Um, anyway. Let's 
get this sold after well gotta wait for that to finish you know what we'll do a bit by hand try to finish the field off by hand I think now I'm tempted to drill this with well this half of those uh, obviously rape and that half over there with um, maize and there's a could there's a chance I could uh, chop it and put it into uh, silage clamp it and then and get silage However, I could, could just get the corn from it. Um, I don't know actually what I should do with that field. Because if I were to do it for there's a clump just in there. Um, so it w would be no well, it won't be that far at all to move it. Um, however, I don't know. I'll have to have a think of it. I need, I need a drill that can handle maize anyway. So I can't be drilling any of that just yet. And I still need... In fact, I honestly don't know why I bought that cotton header. Because I was going to do that for silage anyway. And that would be quite useful actually, if I did. Because um, then I'd be able to move what's in the clamp up here down into the clamp that's at the dairy. And then we can have it all there. Still need a decent higher mean mod. Um, okay. I'll have to have a look about for one of them. That would be the next episode. That could possibly be after, well, tomorrow on the 23rd. And it's the 24th. That will be called the Pack Farm. 25th, Christmas Specials. 26th. I don't know. It could be a couple of reviews actually, just short little videos. Um, Hmm. I don't know, I'll have to have a think of what I do for the next few videos. It could be some more Yorra track. Um, I haven't done that for a while. I'd like to do so actually. Uh, the multiplayer is great fun. Uh, and yeah, you will be seeing some of that soon. But yeah, um, I think I could do Channington Cobble Park Farm for a few days of the week 27th to the whenever it is, the 1st, the 4th, until the 4th, yeah, 27th, no actually, yes, yeah I'll do that, 27th to the 4th, that is uh, quite a while. Oops. And I'll have to make them today or tomorrow. In fact, no, tomorrow it would be. I need time to edit them and render, do all that stuff, render, edit, compress, upload. Hmm, okay. I think of that. Once I've got this field done, I'll unload the combine into trailer and we'll go sell it somewhere for a decent amount of money hopefully and I've still got one more field to do with this combine and then I will be hiring in the crone hopefully in fact now I could get the smaller rost or mash I think that's what it's called I could get the smaller one of them And we still don't have any loan whatsoever. So, uh, in fact, can I even afford to hire that? I need to look into that. Um, 
We don't have any loan out, so it's quite good. So. Park that there. Make sure no idiots decide. Oh, I'm going to go 50 miles an hour down there. And uh, right off his header. <laughs> we empty yet? Come on. Right, let's go sell this. Let's look for a decent. Oh, it's going up. Church that's found two three one four two three eight two. It's not that much difference, but Churchfield Farm is just there. So I will go to Churchfield Farm. Sell it there, and then I'll end the episode, and I'll get a conveyor belt of some sort, download it, and also hire me mod. It's the next one, I think. Yep. Then we can start chopping maize. There's a chance some equipment may have to be sold, sold something or a loan taken out, and just so that we can get the equipment which I need. I don't really know how much space there is here. That is a fair bit, that's okay. To go out the grain? No, that's good. In fact, we have a fair bit of money now. Um, right, let's get back into the field. In fact, no, we'll just park here for now. Right, so. Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed today's episode on Court Farms. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share this video as it really does help and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.